The assembly of the AST-12 is divided into four stations. These each contain a DPU-210 controller and a PKP position control system for two tools. Two AST-12 systems are attached to the PKP. The product is placed on a workpiece carrier VPC, which is manually pushed through the stations. The workpiece carrier is positioned and fixed with stoppers and lifters. The HMI and the pick to light system guarantee operator guidance. The screws are supplied through screw feeders and screw presenters. The following assembly steps are carried out. Station A, placement of the housing as well as assembly of the I.O. and CPU boards. Station B. Installation and assembly of the connectors. Station C. Assembly of the power unit. Station D. Connection of all cables and assembly of the rear housing. Station E is the test station, the end-of-line test. It consists of a DPU-210 and an interface box for the inputs and outputs, as well as all communication interfaces. On this, the AST-12 is connected. A testing and realignment device, which simulates a screwdriver, is connected to the AST-12. From this box, a precision measurement device takes readings. Further, there is a label printer to print the type label. The jobs at these stations are Update to the current AST software level Test of all inputs and outputs Test of all interfaces Test of the USB ports, test of the beeper, test of the touch display, AST-12 verification and realignment, creation and printing of the factory certificate, creation of the type label.